So you can pretty much take anything on the menu and it's gonna you're gonna be happy with it. So I think I'm gonna do the cheesesteak loaded. You, you know, if you get the whole one, it goes like from this side of the counter to the other side of the counter. Just, just I'm just gonna tell Give you. Give me the whole one. All right. Oh, oh thank there you. it is. Beautiful. Wow. Oh, I, I need Good. two trays. God bless you. God bless you, my friend. Thanks, guys. Well, Bob, uh, before we get to this, Penn State number two in the country, yeah. they have the Heisman front runner, but I still feel like they aren't getting enough respect going into this Ohio State game. This is this is now the biggest game of their season. If they can win it, I mean, they are definitely the odds-on favorite to represent the Big Ten East in the Big Ten title game. Saquon Barkley, say bye-bye. There's one thing I know about Penn State right now, and that's that they show up for big games. Ohio State, I'm not so sure. <laughs> yeah. If you look at it, yeah. Oklahoma, they lose at home. Yeah. The playoff game, they get blown out. They should have probably lost to Michigan yeah. last year, and no. they lost to Penn State, and that's their last list of big games. And I think that is one of the reasons why Penn State fans are, are like, what do we have to do sure. to get a little bit more recognition? Well, I mean, the chips are on the table now. If they win in Columbus, I don't think they have to worry about being underdogs for a while. How was your interaction with James Franklin this week? Was he able to hear you on the phone? Hi, James. How are you? Good, Bob. Having a hard time hearing you. I think he might have been messing with me. Yeah. And I was like, oh, no. Not again. Not it's again. like, no, we're good. Oh, no. Not again. Oh, no. I got you now. Uh, all right. Let's give our picks. Well, I don't think I'm going to be very popular after this pick. I'm going to Whoa. pick. I'm going to pick Ohio State 27-24. Okay. I could, I could foresee a situation where Trace McSorley is going to have to win the game in the fourth quarter, and he's mm -hmm. probably he's probably going to prove me wrong. I'm going to go all in, just like I went you all are, in with this cheese right steak now. here. Penn State wins by a very fitting 24-21. <laughs> Same score as last year. Give me the cheese steak. Give me Penn State in the college football playoff.